Hello and now welcome. This is the gamer Zach. And I'm gonna be doing a mod spotlight of the Balix Weapons mod. It's very hard to pronounce, I blame it. On the idea of it. And so started we have spawn eggs. I did this kinda weird. I didn't like put them all in. But it's like it's kinda like the recipes. Most of the time, they're not really special. So anyways, I'll just do the weakest to the strongest one. So let's get first out to the crafting repsies. These are made with two six and one wood. Two six and one diamond. The same way. If I recall... Hmm. Okay, same thing. Now spears. Now we have our test subject here. The subject and will spears do three hearts of damage, regular spears. While diamond does six. However, if you throw them, it does the same thing, but you can pick it up still. Which is very nice. Anyway. Let me put that back in the testing chamber. Over here we uh the strongest weapon of them all. It looks real big on you, but if you right click, however, as you can see, you switch the sides. I know what's the real purpose of this, but on the wooden, you can do three hearts of damage. And that's very simple. That's some girl, random lady. And the six hearts. It's like the spear. However, if you right click, it'll do actually twice as much damage. And oh my god, that's a lot of damage. I know what I know how it is. Let's take more durability, anyways. This is the war axe, bad axe, you regard with it. It does four hearts of damage. And it's crafted like this. Oh yeah, I forgot about the other one. It's crafted with two sticks. Th um, wood on this side, and the wood's like, I don't know, the other things. It's crafted like this, anyways. The di diamond does 7 hearts damage, you can block. Which is always a very nice feature to have. So as the next weapon we have is the war axe. The war axe is made by 2 wood, a child, and 3 sticks. Let's take them in here, and let's... Is a more of our test subject. Honestly, zombies are a little bit problem. Anyways, oh my god, just run out. Anyways, come back here. We're not done with you. It doesn't seem much as the war, the warhammer. However, you can do this. And just make a big explosion. I wonder how much that is. You have to do it on the ground, I think. It's all on me. Let me see here. It's... Oh wait, you have to aim for the ground. Let's see. It does. Okay, I got it. Yeah, got aim for a block. Sup, Jeffrey? So it does four hearts of damage. Good thing I th We're gonna do it over here. Let me see here how much damage it does. It does four hearts. With the diamond, it does 26. And I think it's like an AOU effect, so let me see. That's some background noise. How you do this? It's very weird. And it's the undamaged, just seven hearts. Honestly, I don't know how that really works. And it's just the katana. It's crafted like this. One stick, two wood. It reminds me of like, I don't know. Anyways. The wooden one does one heart of damage. Wow. Come back here, you little booger. Does four hearts. I think this, this is more faster. Or has more durability. I, I don't know. Anyways. I show off the weapons. And we did the melee weapons. Let's do 
these kinds of weapons. This is the flail, and looks super stupid. When it's with the flail, can eh. the one flare can punch off. Left click or right click essentially more or less the same. And just like four hearts, a lot of that does ten hearts. It's way weird how this views. Nice, let's go back here. And this is the knives. Reminds me of Assassin's Creed. And thrown. Or if hit. It does the same amount of damage. So diamond does six and while wood does three. Enough to kill a cow, perhaps. Yeah, say this. Look at that. That's like the best thing ever. And so this is the javelin. And it does. And you basically, if you accidentally hit it not to your target, you can pick it up. But I was trying to miss some bears. This is the musket. There are three variations to it. Actually, a lot of variations to it. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I put that over there. I was thinking of ponies. Perhaps. Anyways, this is the regular musket. You hold right click until it reloads, and you can fire! That's 19 hearts. However, with the wooden... Anyways, you make this with gun stock, which is made like this. And iron like this. Wait, I forgot to show the crafting work. These diamonds. Uh, the, the knife was made by this, and the one fails made like this. No, you won't. No, 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 no. Background noise for people. And this is made with this. So yeah. Anyways, let me see. Of course, we're gonna see the damage. This is one. This does three. While the diamond does. Six. But of course, this is the gun. Only when they come at you. This mouse is the only one come near you with this weapon. Hey, squid. I'm gonna do Scott as Minecraft favor. Come back here, you squid. Anyways, that's just a minute. This guy's micro love me. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, I'm hungry. Wow, me, I'm using meat, <laughs> killing me. Anyways, um, this is the new crossbow, and which does is like the musket. You can tell visibly. And you can hold right click and does 20 hearts of damage when used. Next is the blowgun. Forget about the craft recipes. It's made like this. And the bolts made like this. So anyways, the blowgun is made with three sugar cranes. And the poisonous dart is made by this. Personally I find feathers to be like very time consuming. So as you right click. Well, like, like all the mu other musket and crossbow, when you shoot it, it does only one heart's of damage, but the poisons and slow down your enemies. It's more like a combination with like the musket, perhaps. It's just my thoughts. And next is the blunder. Plus, and he made it like this. Nice. This made it like this. Honestly, you think this is like the pistol? In fact, it looks very small on me. Anyways, but does 12 hearts damage, at least that's what it told me. Next is the boomerang. The boomerang does is both is used as a melee and a range weapon. You can punch mobs with it and it does 2 hearts of damage with it. Um, and on a diamond does freaking 9. It's made with 2 wood, 2 wood, and 1 diamond. But if you throw it, perhaps, like that, it does more, and it comes back to you. 
Like that, I don't know. I heard like Sonic come back at you song. I know that existed. Let me see if it picks up these things. If you hold it longer, it'll go for longer. Nope, it doesn't pick up my things. Wait. Oh, that's cool. Oh yeah, that looks nice. Alright, so down the reach. Let's go to the other. We got this. 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 And this. So anyways, all these are really nice. The, the fire rod is only has one use, but it just sets things on fire. Next is the train dummy, which you can practice all your moves at. You just right click on him and you get back, get right back. Next up we have the dynamite, which... Which doesn't make this guy have a bad day. <laughs> yeah. Just use them all right here. And let me see how big of a hole they make, because this is actually used as a mining tool. I'll say it's very good if you're gonna mine. Unless, but always, never least, so it's the cannonball. And what you do is right click on it with with cannon and gun power, you mount on it, you aim at your target. Hmm. This cow's a subject. You aim at him, and. Boom! It just doesn't exist anymore. With this weapon, nothing will. Anyways, that's the mod. Oh wait, forgot the crafting repsies. This I always forget the crafting repsies. I'll just save that for the last. This dynamite, dynamite. This, this. Mm. I've been new to this. Sorry. And this. Let's celebrate this. Ultimate weapon destruction. Let's set fireworks. For a celebration blow this up. So yeah guys, that's the mod. Subscribe if you like it. Hit that like button to support the channel. And yeah guys. This is Zach, and I'm seeing you out.